regularly. Okay, everyone, I'm here with Akiva and Jonah, and we're here for our first YouTube video, our first father-son do-it-yourself project. What we're doing today is we're making a sump for a 14-gallon bio cube, right? And the idea here is to have a little more water in the system and some place for the filtration. So, here's what we got. For the back of my bio cube, we're gonna put up this eShops Overflow. eShops Overflow. And it came, it came made in China, so the, China. the head for it was metric, so it took a little while to find some fittings uh, that would go into it. Thankfully, we went to Lowe's yesterday, we spent a lot of time there, and the man we saw had four fish tanks at home and knew exactly what we needed. Let's not break it because it took forever to put that together. So we're eventually going to hook up the half tube vinyl tubing, half inch vinyl tubing, it's going to flow into here. And we're going to have one chamber for our yeah. protein skimmer, the Aquamax protein skimmer. Aquamax protein skimmer. We're going to have a small protein little chamber for a refugium where we're going to put some, throw some macroalgae and chato. Chamber here. Chamber here. And the last Aquamax. filter we're going to have for our return pump, and we have a MaxiJet 400, and the MaxiJet, the MaxiJet 400 is going to filter up the water. A MaxiJet 400. To our fast, to our two. Can I see some? To our two little fishies phosphate reactor, phos 150, and then we have a MaxiJet 1200 to set it back into can I go, the Can I talk tank. now? Hold on. So now what we're going to do... Okay, there's an occupational therapist watching the show. <laughs> and now what we're going to do... Can we edit that out? Yes. <laughs> now what we're going to do is we are going to fit all the equipment so we know exactly where to put our baffles, right? The baffles are going to tell us where to put the water flow. Baffles. And tomorrow morning, we are going to go ahead and we are going to silicone the baffles in. The first thing we're going to do tonight is just mark off where we are going to build these baffles. we need the tape off? No, we're going to need that tape. So... Uh, add your red magic marker. This middle chamber here is going to be, our, to be our refugium. And up right, here, that's it's going to be our bubble trap. Marker, which is you can't know that you're gonna need. We're gonna need okay, Jonah, take that washable marker. I need you to make a little line right here where that first baffle is going. Oh. You are very good at art, Jonah, so you can do this. Do a little darker so you can see it tomorrow morning, okay? okay. I can't do it. Oh. And I'm glass man. Daddy, I only can do it. Can I do it? Yeah, do that one too. Okay. Wait, on this side? Yep. Need another glass? And then one over here. Okay. Okay? All right, so tomorrow morning we're going to go ahead and silicone. What we're going to do is we're going to silicone this one first in the morning, then we're all going to go to a movie. We're going to see Spider-Man. As you can see, Jonah's a big Spider-Man fan. <laughs> we're going to come back, we're going to do the other two, and it takes 48 hours to cure, and hopefully it'll be water sealed. All right, see you next time on step two.